Pickup and gaming women is a skill that you should try to learn if you are in your 20s or 30s. This is not only because you want to sleep with more women, but I believe that improving these skills also increases your value as a man. If you are in this age range, you should definitely try to learn this skill. You start to understand female nature and social dynamics, but even more than that, you understand how to read people and how to turn women on. You also understand how to deal with different types of people, and these skills are essential everywhere. The best thing about learning games is that these skills transcend boundaries and can be applied to many areas. You can use what you've learned to improve your social standing, and it can even help your business because you are socially such a natural. If you keep this in mind and keep an open mind, all of these things will start to make sense, and knowing this will help you change your life. The first thing that you need to hear is that the more attractive she is, the harder you have to work. I don't mean this in a negative way, rather, I mean that the more attractive she is, the harder you have to be. This is the reality of the world we live in, and it's better to embrace it than to get triggered by it. You need to stop putting her on a pedestal every time you interact with a girl who's a 10 out of 10 on the attractiveness scale. It's very hard to fight off the feeling of swooping over her. It's easy to put her on a pedestal every time you interact with a girl. If you treat a woman like a celebrity, guess how she's going to treat you? She's pretty much going to treat you like a fan. All of my friends in the dating circle and playing games do the same thing, and so does every Manosphere channel. The more you do this, the more you raise the pedestal. The more you treat her like an attractive woman, the more you're boosting her ego and subconsciously placing yourself at the bottom. Every woman likes to think that she's beautiful when she… This is the first naked fact that you have to come to terms with. Always remember to treat yourself with respect, even when interacting with beautiful ladies. The more attractive she is, the harder and colder you need to be with her. Never forget that she is still a human being at the end of the day, and don't let yourself forget that raw truth. Number 2. Ignore her words and pay attention to her actions. This is something that even the top Manosphere Gs will tell you. Think about how a woman behaves when she is interested in. Many times, a woman will test you in order to make you believe that she is not attracted to you. She might call you short or point out a flaw you have, but you need to notice what she's doing, how she talks to you, and how she looks at you. The most important thing for you to do in this situation is to hold the frame when she's throwing tests if you like that. When she's telling you that you this is considerably more relevant when considering cold pickups. Okay guys, it's time for road truth number 3. This is a big one because I believe it should be carved into every man and guy who is in their early 20s, and that is the mindset of not chasing women, but rather becoming a man that women want to chase. If you chase something it means you want it more, it means it's running from you, and you are desperate to get it. This is not the mindset you should have when it comes to women. Your goal should be to the more masculine you give off, the easier it is to attract women and the more confident you feel too. Women who you previously pursued and who rejected you will see you in a very different light when they see you with a better woman. This is something that is ingrained in the female nature. This is something that a lot of research has shown as well. And it's how women decide whether or not they are attracted to others. If women see you with your new girls, they will be more interested in you if they see you with different women. If they see you with different women, they will be less interested in you. If she already has a boyfriend, men are not like that. They won't be interested in going out with her further. However, women are not like men in this regard. After you start going out with the ladies and dating, you will notice that women find you more attractive. I thought for a second that you had a friend who wanted to go somewhere with you, but the girl you liked wouldn't talk to him, so he moved. Ten years later, your friend is a successful movie star who is getting lots of attention from girls. What do you think the girl's reaction will be? She will change her feelings for him overnight because now he has the power of social proof, except that you will be turned down. Rejection is an inevitable part of a man's path, and you will be turned down time and time again in his pursuit of goals. These goals may involve women, or they may involve other things. Even the best pickup artists get their work turned down time and time again. Even the most attractive man on the planet wouldn't have a conversion rate of 100%, so you need to understand that rejection is a natural part of the dating game. A large portion of the dating game is also determined by personal preference. If you properly leveled yourself up, most women out there are going to find you attractive as a man, but a lot of women won't. You just need to pick yourself up when that happens and continue on because it happens. You can't let it get you. Our brains are still hardwired to be afraid of rejection because, back in the day in tribal societies, being rejected meant having to live as an outcast. 
Living alone greatly decreased survival rates because you had to find your own food and go out hunting. This is why our brains are still hardwired to be afraid of rejection. The only way to overcome this is to become mentally stronger. Being mentally strong is the most important masculine trait, and you need to master it because women aren't going to be the only ones who reject you. Number 7. The Brutal Truths Leave behind a lady who has rejected you. Men have a propensity to make their lives more complicated than they need to be. However, if a guy adheres to the right rules, it is nearly impossible for him to make a mistake. Staying away from women who have turned you down is the most effective way for men to keep their mental peace and make life easier. A man's greatest strength is his ability to remain grounded and keep a clear mind, and he should not let his emotions cloud his judgment. You should not harbor resentment toward the woman who turned you down. Instead, you should get over it and move on. Number 8. Avoid disclosing your frailties to female companions. Don't ever lay your weakness down in front of a woman. The moment you do that, she is going to take your weakness and destroy you. It's very likely that she will use it in a future argument or exploit that weakness in some way. Truth number 9 below tolerance. Be ready to walk away at any given moment if you're in the beginning stages of a relationship with a woman and you're trying to understand her. If you're in the beginning stages of a relationship with a woman and you've been working on bettering yourself as a man and raising your value, the women that attract you should be of the same caliber. If she doesn't appreciate you as a man, you shouldn't put up with it since it will only get worse with time. The tenth undeniable fact is the very last one. You should never let the harsh realities of life make you bitter. There are so many men in this world who go on YouTube and cry and rant about how women complain about life, thinking this and that. Either they are ignorant about the nature of women or they are unable to stomach it. In either case, you should never let the harsh realities of life make you bitter. Simply come to terms with the fact that women and men are built in fundamentally different ways. It serves no use to point the finger at women or to moan about something that men cannot alter. If you want to settle down, you need to get over the pain of rejection and work on bettering yourself. God will also send the appropriate woman into your life at the proper time to make things better. The essential thing is that you don't forget these things. Don't forget to click the thumbs up button. If you enjoyed the story and the lesson it attempted to teach you, I would appreciate it if you would subscribe to my channel and let me know in the comment section below that you have done so. After that, I will provide a response to your observation. Also, if you want more stories like this one to be published, please leave a comment below indicating that you want to see it happen.